What's good guys, it's your boy Stegenix here and we are back for another Stegenix feed and this time I have a really really good surprise for you guys. Um, I have introduced this software before but I am going to introduce it again because you know not everyone here is old like the others so there's our newcomers and not all people know this particular software and it is really really good for all the gamers not just gamers okay but also for utility use multitasking and all of that other stuff okay now the software name is on top replica and it is by codeplex i believe so i'll put the link on the description below so you guys can download that safely without any spyware um basically what this does it is it duplicates the window that you also ever desire to duplicate like for example um, if you are playing anime ninja and the chat is too small well you can use this to duplicate the uh, particular area slash region and you will see it bigger it makes it bigger you can um, make it full screen or half screen click through or a lot more okay so um, also it works for League of Legends as well of course and um, as you guys can see here on the screen I am uh, using my second monitor as the map all right it can do this as well okay there is no bounds to this as you guys can see here um it can show you the full map um it also tells you you know basically whatever is going on on your main screen and it's really really good to use no lags or nothing and um and it's free to use that is the best part of that one is that it is free to use and also one more trick that you can do with on top replica is that um if you only have two screens you can make um you know you can make it basically into three simply by um duplicating a particular window and what happens here is like you guys see on the screen um there's a video playing that is you know a video in YouTube and on the second screen as well uh, basically what's happening here is there's team in the background and on my main monitor is basically the one that is playing on the other side but what you do here is you don't minimize the thing and um, what you do here is you just select a different window as I am demonstrating here on the video as you guys can see um, I am playing um, Anime Ninja and watching Anime Ninja video on the second screen while Steam is running on the background. So basically, it enhances your um, multitasking and it's really, really good. Um, you know, you don't have to switch from screen to screen. On top, Replica will always be on top. And no matter what as long as you don't minimize or nothing interrupts the flow of the video of the source then it's going to continue playing on top of any other window all right and um for installation okay what you do here is go into the website as you guys can see right here and you download the thing and after you download the the setup is pretty much basic so you know it's it's almost like a no-brainer so download click click install file path and you run the program and once you run the program obviously it's going to pop a empty screen like so as you guys can see here on the screen and now what you do here is you right click the um, the window and you select the window and you choose what window you want to duplicate like for example you want to duplicate um on top home google chrome okay so it's going to duplicate that you double click the window so it duplicates the window and it 
duplicates it in full size. So what you are seeing now here on the screen is actually the duplication of that particular window. So whatever you do here, you cannot click, right? So in the event that you want this to be clickable, there is also a setting for that. So you guys can see, enable quick, um, enable click through, and there are other modes here, all screen standard, um, also the uh, other windows, the opacity of the on top screen replica. So you guys can pretty much, you know, manipulate the program to your desire. All right, um, let's go exit out of that. So once you have this, this duplicate window, no matter what happens, it's going to be on top of other windows, right? It's going to be on top. Doesn't matter what happens as long as nothing interrupt the flow of that particular window that is being duplicated, all right? Like I said, so whatever happens, it's going to duplicate the same thing, okay? And um, if you want to zoom in on something, here's just what you do. This works on League of Legends as well as I've, um, as I've demonstrated. The second screen has become the, um, the map, of course, right? Um, what you do is right click, all right, once you, once you have selected a window to be duplicated, you right click once again, okay? And then you select region. Now it's going to bring up this um, layout right here. Everything is widened. And what you do here is you crop the area that you want. For example, you want to crop or you want something to be zoomed in, but of course, Windows won't allow it. What you do is on top replica, okay? So you get that and you crop it and there you go. Now, if you are not happy, you can always reset and go for something else as I am demonstrating right here and it is zoomed. So if something is really small and you need something to magnify it, um, you know, on top replica is always on top. So what you do here is once you have selected a um, particular window to be duplicated, what you do is here in advance, okay? There is one click through, enable click through, enable click forwarding. Here is the one that you like, okay? Click forwarding basically makes the on top replica window kind of like the main window that is duplicating. So like for example, let's do this, all right? This is click throughable now. I mean, click forwarding. This is click forwarding now. So I want you guys to pay close attention to what's going to happen. You see that? I am going to click formation and it clicks the formation and um, I'll exit out of that and it exits close that so basically like for example okay for example you're doing an edit okay as you guys can see right here you're doing an edit on a particular software and you don't want your game to be out of the way of what you are mainly doing and you don't want your game you know to be minimized so what you do you click on on top replica and it's it's going to click forward so like what i'm doing here right now um the game is still on now i can crop this okay but once you you put it on click forwarding mode you cannot crop it anymore so i suggest that you crop it before you enable click forwarding because the only way you can do this again is by closing the program and um, relaunching the same process or doing the same process basically okay but um, like i said it's right there it, it won't interrupt the flow of what you are doing everything still works the same okay and at the same time you can still play your game yeah i think that's it i hope you guys enjoyed this episode of stage next speed if you guys do don't forget to leave a thumbs up and uh, if you guys don't well you guys know what to do all right and if you haven't subscribed yet definitely definitely hit that subscribe button so you guys will get notified if i have new videos out in the channel all right and as always i'll see you all on the next video Take care and peace.